Spoiler alert is in theaters now. Well, you know, here on ISF, we had to keep on bringing you more of the Real Housewives of Miami. Yes, yes, y'all. And its newest star, its newest housewife, Julia Lemgoba, spent some time on ISF and shared what we can expect from this new season. And she dropped the bombshell. I'm very curious. Let's take it back to the beginning. When you were approached to do this show, knowing what reality TV entails, what did you think? I was kind of a reality TV virgin. To be really honest, I've never watched any show, any reality TV show ever in my life until one morning when Adriana calls me and invites me to be her friend on the show. I was like, oh my God, girl, well, we have so much fun in life with you. I'm sure it's going to be so much fun <laughs> with camera on. Let's try it. And then I like, what do you call it in English? Bench watch, whatever, you know, I did a season per day. Season a one, se oh, hold two, on. a season the per whole day. Season. Ten episodes in one uh -huh. day. Yes, Martina was like, Julia, hello, are you ready for dinner? Darling, wait. And I just watched and watched and watched because I needed to know. I wanted to imagine, like, can I imprint myself into this? Can I do this? How will it work? I'm learning about the girls, seeing the whole dynamic. Three days, three episodes, boom, I'm a pro. And here you are, a first for any of the franchises in the Bravo-verse, being the first LGBTQ plus housewife. That's huge. Finally, I wanna say it's about time mm -hmm. that, you know, uh, we can be represented um, in this great format. So people around the world and in America, you know, who still have some hate in them and not acceptance could see that my family with Martina and my daughters is just like any other family. I mean, always saying love has no gender and I'm a living proof of it. And that's what motivates me. One of the things of reality TV is drama, a lot of confrontation, a lot of um, <laughs> he said, she said, mm -hmm. but you handled that a little bit differently. I have my standards. I have my values. They are what they are. If my friend is in trouble, I go at any lengths to protect my friends, you know, and always will be there for them. And I'm not afraid. I mean, there is, honestly, there is nothing much in this life which can scare me. I've been through worse. So having some girls, you know, fighting about something, it's like, okay, it's almost like chickens in my chicken coop. I hear this noise, but I know I have my opinion and I'm not afraid to say it. You survived your freshman season. <laughs> what can we expect <laughs> from season two and what growth are we going to see from yourself, Julia? Because I'm a rebel in my heart and kind of a, I jump into things head first. I thought, you know what? Um, I'm scared, but I'm going to break my fear. I'm going to try. And at my age and few sizes plus that I used to be, <laughs> I decided to go back into modeling. Congratulations. And guess what? It's working out. It's worked out. So I have my new modeling career in fashion, which is amazing that fashion changed, shifted a little bit. So now you don't have to be super, super young and super, super skinny. There is diversity and acceptance in all ages and sizes, which is incredible. And it goes beyond this for me because on the show, you don't have to, it's not just in the fashion world. It can be in any other profession or just within a person. It's just kind of there. And I'm a little bit of a daredevil. And <laughs> you so, said you're a rebel. Uh, well, yes, yes. Well, I had to, my life was pretty rocky. <laughs> so um, I survived it and, um, you know, kind of rebelling the boxes and rebelling the boxes and drawers. Julia Lemgova, it has been so awesome having you in studio. And again, congratulations on the season two. It's going to be great. Thank you.